Open up door. And dog, the dog, the ball dogs, the ant dog show back with another video. And uh, today we're gonna talk about uh, 50 Cent sophomore album, The Massacre, uh, released back in the year 2005, featuring the uh, tracks just a little bit. Candy Shop, Hated to Love It, the remix with G Unit, and uh, Disco Inferno. And uh, a lot of people has issues with this album. They feel like it was a flop. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I understand that it didn't live up to the expectations of Get Rich or Die Trying. But this album, in my personal opinion, is actually is actually dope. You know what I'm saying? No, it is not fucking with Get, with Get Rich or Die Train. Not by a long shot. But uh, the album isn't all that bad. You know what I'm saying? I know people want that gangster music. You know what I'm saying? This and that and the third. I know they wanted a follow-up. You know what I'm saying? Like a Get Rich or Die Train part two. But, you know, hey, 50 got his eyes on him now. They like, you know, he, he, you know, you gave us that, you know what I'm saying? That's cool. You know how it go in the game, man. They let you do what you do your first album. You know what I'm saying? Then the second one, you know, it's pretty much, we got to, uh, we got to get on the commercial side of things. You know what I'm saying? So, uh. That album actually was not all that bad, you know what I'm saying? Like, I really love music, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I don't always wanna listen to gangster music, you know what I'm saying? Like, I love music all the way around. Rap, R&B, I love rock, you know what I'm saying? I love jazz, I, I, I love all different types of music, you know what I'm saying? So. I actually thought The Massacre was a good album, you know what I'm saying? I didn't like every track, but me personally, it was about an eight and a half, maybe a good nine, you know what I'm saying? I actually liked it, the album. The uh, intro, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I'm not mistaken, um, I thought it was supposed to be another title, if I'm not mistaken. I can't remember right now, that was over, some, I don't know how many years ago. But uh, I, I thought it was gonna be another title, but then, man, when he came back with the, uh, the name, yeah, I think it was gonna be called the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. And uh, it came, he came with the massacre. I'm like, I ain't feeling this title. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I wanted like the, the same thing going, like, okay, get rich or die trying. I got rich, you know what I'm saying, and something else would have been the second album name, but whatever, you know what I'm saying. I am big on the al album names, you know what I'm saying. I'm just, I don't, I hate when artists name their titles just anything, you know what I'm saying. Because uh, that title did not at all fit the album. There was nothing massacre about the album, but it was it was dope though. I liked it, you know what I'm saying, and uh, you know. The intro, you know what I'm saying? Then you got uh, In My Hood coming in at number two. I love that record, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I really didn't care for, I forgot track three. Um, I forgot track three, but I like, I'm supposed to die tonight. I didn't care for Gatman and Robin. I didn't care for that at all. I didn't care for just a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Ride of music, my toy soldiers. So amazing. Uh, position of power, God gave me style. Man, the uh, the out of control. Uh, that's the album version. I didn't like the, uh, you know what I'm saying, the beat that he used for um, radio play and music videos. I didn't like that. But uh, I thought the album, you know what I'm saying, was dope me personally and it's like what I do is I like to get on social media and I like to share what albums I'm listening to you know what I'm saying and that album happened to be 
today's album and I cannot wait to get on social media to see the negative comments that everybody got to say about it because every time I do listen to that album and I post you know what I'm saying people always want to comment trash you know what I'm saying or something negative but the album was not that bad I understand it didn't meet up to the expectations of Get Rich or Die Trying but you can't expect a nigga to you know what I'm saying how is he gonna do that he, I'm not saying that he can't but how is he gonna top that you cannot top Get Rich or Die Trying you know what I'm saying but the massacre was straight it was straight I don't like the title you know what I'm saying but it, it was straight you know what I'm saying? Oh, nice car, old school. He got a car from the 50s with the top down. But yeah, man. He, oh, okay, he do too. I see him. We got, we got white and we got red. But yeah, man, I, you know, the massacre, man, in my personal opinion, was straight, man. I just want to know, uh, how do you guys feel about the massacre? Was it dope? Was it whack? You know what I'm saying? What's your favorite track on there? Do you have a favorite track at all? How did you feel about the singles? I didn't care about the singles too much. You know what I'm saying? I didn't like Disco Inferno. I didn't like just a little bit. I didn't like Candy Shop. I ain't like none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? I didn't. But the other songs on the album. There was other songs on the album that I, oh, Piggy Bank, that diss record, that shit was fire. Piggy Bank was hard, you know what I'm saying? And uh, it'll come to me if there's some more tracks, but like I said, you know, I didn't care for the singles, but the other songs on the album, you know what I'm saying? Everybody gonna be curious to hear what 50 gotta say, you know what I'm saying? So of course, you know, we about to get back on here we about to tap into this new album but uh you know i just wanted to you know throw this video out there and see what my followers think you know what i'm saying you know how does y'all feel about the massacre you know what i'm saying what is it out of 10 10 being the greatest one being the worst what was it out of a 10 let me know in the comment section you know what i'm saying and like I said, don't get me wrong, I know it ain't got nothing on Get Rich or Die Trying, but I still enjoyed the album. It was pretty good, you know what I'm saying? I know it was on the commercial side, I know it was on the R&B side, but, you know, the album was pretty, pretty nice to me, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, this Ant Dog, Ant Dog Show, talking about 50 Cent's debut, I mean, sophomore album, The Massacre. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think. And, uh, yeah, just get at me, man. All right, Ant Dog, dogs out.